Hey, good morning, good morning, good morning. How are you doing? My name is Spirit Monda. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, guys. My Saturday was full of activities, so come and see what did I do during my weekend. So we are going to see what I did during my week, my Saturday and Sunday. And so on this specific day, I went to see my cousin who lives just close to where we live. She lives around, and so. We went milking, as you can see, we went milking, we're milking the goats. Yes, that's what she gives her children. Goat milk is so healthy, if you do not know. It's usually used by children to boost their immunity, the old, those people with uh, some sickness like the chronic diseases. Yes, it, it is quite good for boosting their health. So... I would advise someone to have a goat if they want their children to have quite a good health instead of a instead of a what do you call it instead of a cow. The nutrition in goat's milk it's quite high compared to that of a cow. And I hope that's what we are doing. And so when you're milking a goat, you can say it's eating. You give it some feeds. I don't know how other people does, but for my grandma or even the same way I can see with my cousin. You give, you give the goat some feed to keep it active and ensure that it's not moving. And so it will concentrate in giving the milk, okay? Yeah, that's why you can see it's being given the milk, the feeding. This is, I think it's called dairy milk. Yeah, that's dairy milk. And so we are done. You can see these are about one and a half liters. So done with milk, we are going to clean the compound. And guess who is cleaning the compound? I, I, I am the cleaner. So I'm going to clean this compound. In the village, you need to clean your compound. It can just stay with it. With anywho, even, uh, even in towns, you have to clean your compound. Maybe the corridors, the balconies. That's your compound. So that's what we are doing here and the beauty of the village you can see the spacing and the freshness you can see that it's just something different i really love village life it's quite enthusiastic it's quite uh breathtaking i i actually wish i had an option because i would go and live in the village somewhere where there is better just just freshness yeah so we are, I'm going to clean this compound and help my cousin because it was quite a tough and full a day of full of activities. Yes, that's how we do it over here. You can see when you're cleaning the compound in the village, you need to clean under the fence. I don't know if you can see the fence around just be behind me yeah you need to clean under it because it drops some leaves if you do not clean those leaves will continue dropping and then eventually they will overflow on the main compound yeah she had the compound is quite dirty because she had someone to do it but uh, it's like they didn't want to do it so she opted to had to ha seek for some help and then here i was how do you see my auntie my cousin's home it's quite beautiful right yeah it's such a nice place it's such a cool place i would choose village life over and over again as long as it's not uh it's not as long as Haina Mateso, yeah? As long as it's comfortable, as long as it's good that you can, you can, as long as it's not, it's not tedious, not really tedious, as long as it's a good life. I don't know how to, to explain it, yeah. Speaking of the village life, can you see, can you spot my little baby? Can you spot him? Yes, he's the guy on top of that hill of sand. That guy loves, he loves, ah, I can't even emphasize enough. He's enjoying himself in the village. Every single day he feels like, it's only that he can't say it. I think he can just tell me, mom, I want to stay here. He loves this place, the playing, the children, the freedom of playing outside without being told, move, don't, allow, don't, do this. Yes, that freedom. 
Ah, he feels like he can stay here forever. Yeah, he's quite happy. He's enjoying himself. He's not disturbing. As long as there's nothing that he can destroy or uh, there's no water that he can touch, touch outside, he is good. He will not disturb you. He will just mind his business during the entire day while you're busy working. That's how good, how excellent the village life is for my little baby. Next, we are washing our clothes. I'm telling you, we washed. Here we had washed for the whole day. Like uh, for the for about three hours yes we had washed like for the for three hours and so we were just cleaning the shoes that was that's always the last part of cleaning my cousin was quite tired she was the one doing the cleaning i don't really love washing clothes no me i don't like washing clothes i'll do other small small errands but washing clothes no not for me at all this is the next day it's on Sunday, the favorite of all days in the village. What? This is the day you go, relax, sing, dance. Hey. So here you are. Okay, so in our church, in our village, we have presentations. And so here youth, are this youth? Yeah, youth who are presenting. And boom, here is the church choir and guess who is dancing in the church choir you was faithfully me can you see how well i'm dancing uh -huh. what what uh -huh. Uh -huh. Good. Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. it's like i'm just part of the choir can you really imagine that i didn't even practice i just felt like oh they were dancing so cool and had really missed dancing this is how we used to do it when I was young. We used to practice during Saturdays and Sundays we present to the church. Oh, life was awesome. And I, when I went to church on this day, I missed dancing. And I thought, like, I should remind myself how it was. It was back then when I was, when I was just a youth. And then... After the so much dancing, there was, of course, children were being blessed so that they can go to Sunday school. Yeah, there's this session of blessing the children, protecting them with the blood of Jesus. And so that was the pastor's wife who was blessing the children before we head to the preaching. Why? I did not want to know who was preaching. Can you take a guess? Can you take a guess? I don't think you would get it. Ah, oh, drum rolls. Do you know who the preacher is? You was faithfully. No, let me leave it that way. You will see who it is. So in the meantime, let's pray for the children and allow them to move because the main reason children go to Sunday school is to make sure that parents get ample time to listen because children are so destructive. Why? Especially those in the terrible two age. Oh, 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 oh. I can't talk enough because I'm there. I know I have first hand experience. And so after they are gone, here we decide it's time for giving offering. And this is the time you dance, dance, dance. You sing until you feel you are satisfied. So we are dancing and singing before we. Uh, head to the preaching, so let's see.
And now we are seated. It's that time, that most important time of the church service. It's time to listen from the word of God. And as I told you, do you guess who the pastor is? Can you guess? It's yours firstly, my mama. So on this very day, my mama was the preacher. I was privileged to be part of the congregation. Ah, it was so much fun seeing her preach. It has been so long. Anywho, let's listen to what she has. So that's the end of our service and we are going home. So guys, I'm hoping you enjoyed this video that we have come to an end. And if you have not subscribed, kindly consider subscribing. Turn on the notification bell so that anytime I post a view, a new episode, YouTube will notify you. Thank you very much. I will see you in my next video.